The title of this anime promises only the pinnacle of quality. Love Lab. Probably anime of the decade. Oh good, another all-girls school show. Looks like I'm right. It's the epitome of originality already. Surely not otaku bait at all. Okay, so it turns out that the pandering isn't quite as intense as you might think, but it's definitely still there. For example, you don't even need to put on Yuri goggles to see Yuri undertones, and how the boy of Maki's dreams is apparently generic and butt ugly, and she makes out with a Makura of him. Wish fulfillment, anyone? And it turns out that the show isn't quite as janky as it lets on either. The two characters introduced in this first episode are actually decently likable, but it's already established a general formula regarding how they will interact. Brown hair says something, black hair misinterprets what she says or does something stupid, then brown hair hits her or puts her in a headlock. It's mildly entertaining, but I seriously question how much actual comedy they'll be able to milk from their premise without running out of new material, or just resorting to purely lowbrow shit. I predict it'll get old pretty quickly, but I'm not going to waste any more time on it to find out. I have better things to do. This is just one of those anime that you watch when there's nothing to watch. It ain't complete shit, but it's definitely not going to be anything more than mediocre.